Hey guys, what is going on? So we have another request out of the Fiverr. Uh, this is going to be from Millennia Productions. Now they do a lot of like variety stuff based on like the, the strange and peculiar and combining elements of like the unusual and paranormal and all that kind of stuff and dressing it up in uh, ideas loosely based off of their dreams. And they make these episodes of like a kind of like Doctor Who thing. It's called Maybe Who. Uh, and they sent me episode 3 called Time Gangers to check out. Now, if you're interested in any of this kind of stuff, if it sounds great to you, like I said, you can go and check them out at Millennia Productions. Not Millennial, but Millennia. And you'll know you're on the right channel because they have this Miss Bengal series. I highly recommend it. Um, bunch of episodes of that, the, the Maybe Who series, which we're going to check out. Tons of stuff. Tons of content. You'll love it there. But anyway, I'm Kyle Spivak. I'm a rapper and reactor here on YouTube, Spotify, iTunes, TikTok, DoorDash. Whatever you got, I'm going to be there. Uh, got to pull my plugs aside. This is going to be a lengthy video, so strap in. <laughs> Don't know how much we're going to comment on because it is a story time thing. But uh, I got myself a bottle of water, which I'm already starting to kind of need. Uh, but anyway, like I said, it's called Maybe Who Episode 3, Time Gangers. And it is on the Millennia Productions channel. Once again, check them out. All right, here we go. Sometime in the past. just like homemade and it's pretty good uh, and like the cinematography going on and everything the sound design like I've never really messed with any of this stuff so like this is it's really good like the way the production is done I'm liking it and honestly the little bit of jank in the visuals and like animation kind of adds to the creepy element so I'm already interested and it does feel like a Doctor Who episode <laughs> What? That's you! Jump around. Is 
this the Doctor Who theme? I have no idea. Pretty fire. <laughs> Just the most epic. Yeah. Episode 3 Time Gangers. Hmm, what's this? The TARDIS has picked up. Strength and energy region from my hotel and location. I should probably go and have a look. Sorry, my Doctor Who knowledge is a little bit shaky. Oh yeah, I know it's a TARDIS, a sonic screwdriver. Is that how it's teleport? What? That scene right there, the way like, with the sound and everything, uh, it just reminds me of a movie I've seen. I just can't think of what it was. It was a time travel movie, really good, like that. I like how that was animated. <laughs> Strut though. On the stupidest thing, I know. I love this detail right here with the animation. When stepping up, like up there, like stepped on the parking block and everything, like that's how I do it sometimes. <laughs> but I just never really see that in animation. Everything's perfect. But I like that. That's a unique move. Wait, what? Kill you, Marvel Hostel. 
shit. Oh. That's badass. So I don't care. Ooh, that was fun. This is sick.
<laughs> so what? expect to enjoy so much uh or as much as i enjoyed it i mean i don't know how to phrase that i thought i would enjoy it but i enjoyed it way more than i thought like the concept was really good and like i was just astonished at, like the cinematography to it like all those like good like sweeping shots switching the first person i do like storyboard like what is it? like just the storytelling and all that the way the shots were planned and everything like so good and then like it's it was just so negligible, the fact that you're using, like, a, a whole video, like, oh, I thought you just animated it yourself at first. Then I caught on it was Grand Theft Auto, but, like, it didn't detract from it at all that you are using a video game, you know? It's, like, literally, it was just good storytelling through and through. Shots, the cinematography, yeah, there might have been some little jank here and there. Uh, but, like, mm -hmm. uh, I honestly thought that when he was climbing up the tower at the end, he was 
gonna be shot by himself and it would loop back in on the whole beginning because I like those kind of like predestination paradox type things but pretty cool concept nonetheless and then I did not expect the clock to just like knock him off the tower and everything and the epic fall it really gave me like a lot of vibes of like I said like predestination with like kind of like the time and loop of this uh, Doctor Who of course is the inspiration but I did kind of feel more of like a like the new Batman movie or like Dark Knight or something like it just felt so Gotham-y you know like really really leaned into that and then some of the action and stuff and like scenes were like a little like over top dramatic kind of like RRR the new like uh, indie film or whatever Indian film I should say um, so like it had like a lot of the good like those I love all of those things I just mentioned basically so uh, this gets a 5 out of 5 for me, or like 10 out of 10, whatever like number system you want to use, 100 out of 100. Uh, I, I think I kind of want to go watch the rest of these, but I will save that for another time. You guys go check it out, Millennia Productions. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. I just want to give a quick shout out to everyone over on the Patreon, the Reaction Faction, like the Juice Main, and the legend himself, Bobby Cheese, and... If you want yourself shouted out in my videos, as well as your request on mandatory, well then, go over and check out the Patreon and consider donating today. Anyway, I'm out. Over you, Joe!